All right, guys, how you doing? It's Rabia. I hope you're all well. In this video, I wanted to uh, firstly celebrate Neural DSP's birthday because I think they're now five years old. In any case, if some of you aren't aware, there is a birthday sale right now going on the Neural DSP website offering 50% off all the plugins bar the new Mesa one. And I figured that this would be a cool opportunity in case some of you have picked up my archetype plugin or you're thinking about it to show you some of the new presets that I've made and included in the latest update of my plugin. I also just want to say uh, that I'm really excited to use this in a video for the first time. I'll do a proper video of it soon, but this is my new artist model prototype of an Ernie Ball Music Man Sabre. So it's really cool that I've got this and now I can use it in a video. It's got my silo humbuckers in it, so should be familiar with those tones if you've watched my channel for a while. Um, but I'm just going straight into my Apollo interface, into the computer. We're using uh, screen grab software and you're hearing essentially straight into the Apollo X4 interface. So uh, no other post-processing has been done to this video. One last thing that you might be interested in is for all those watching this video. Firstly, thank you for watching. Secondly, uh, I've made a couple more presets since the update because uh, I'm always tweaking and making presets with this plugin. So I will include those in a link in the description box. So if you've got this plugin, you'll get some extra presets that don't come uh, with the plugin just yet because we can only add new presets with each update. So you should be able to see the screen grab of my plugin uh, right now. And we're currently messing around with a preset that I made just this morning called an ambient hole. <laughs> That's one of the presets you'll find in the description box. But in any case, let's move on. We'll start with something funny. This is called One Finger Glory. The cool thing with this preset is that it utilizes uh, it utilizes the mix control in the synth where I've created a harmony and it's blended with the sort of dry signal. So you end up getting this really cool sound. One thing that you might want to do is adjust the EQ um, to work better for you. So. That's called One Finger Glory. This one's called Plump Gains. Now the idea with this one is utilizing the high gain amp and essentially what I'm doing is, it's got less gain, but I'm running the Paragon Overdrive in front. Let me give you a demonstration of how it sounds. <laughs> It's worth pointing out that I also added uh, delay and reverb to this, but I turned them off just in case you didn't want them on originally. <laughs> So that's cool. That's called Plump Gains. 
So I think also a really cool one that I added is called Silky Smooth Gain. And the idea with this one and also Soft Squishy Lead, I believe both of these are new, uh, was when I was learning the Alan Hines uh, Do Not, what's it called now? Uh, Falling Up. Uh, I was about to say Do Not Look Down, which is a Meshuggah song. Uh, but anyway, yeah, the, the Silky Smooth Gain and the Soft Squishy Lead, I think I used those for, uh, or one of those for that cover. <laughs> So as you can hear, it's kind of like wanted to emulate like a loud amplifier that's really pushed. And I'll quickly show you the soft squishy lead one. <laughs> So you get the idea there. One thing that's nice that you can do with these uh, plugins, of course, is you can unlink the uh, head and cab. So in this one, I'm using the crunch cab, but in the silky smooth gain, I'd swapped it over to the V30 cab. So you can hear the difference. Okay, what else did I add? Straight up high gain and then straight up high gain with EQ in case you didn't, uh, you just wanted to dial in a preset real fast. So this is straight up high gain. And then if I show you it with the EQ. Okay, this one's called Fear Me, and uh, if anyone can guess from the sound of it. Essentially, I was trying to do the Mick Gordon thing. Um, and as you can see, I've added quite a bit of EQ. Again, you can boost that if you want a little more clarity out of it. Maybe that's a bit too much, but you get the idea. This is another one that I made called Lush Tone. into that kind of natural uh, harmonic overtone thing. It's really fun. What is cool about this one? Yep, I'm using the compressor a bunch and I've actually got the vintage overdrive setting on the Paragon there. In case you didn't know, the vintage mode and the modern mode on any of these pedals are completely 
separate pedals. It's not just like an EQ shift. As in, in the Paragon Overdrive situation, in the modern mode, it's like a tube screamer, but it's got an extra bass control. And then in the vintage mode, I think it's like uh, some sort, maybe it's the EP boost or something like that. I can't actually remember what we chose. They're completely separate pedals by the flick of a switch, which I think is really cool. Right, this is a really fun one. This is called Bone Grinder Synth because it's totally sick. And basically what it does is the oscillations uh, speed up the higher up the fretboard you go. So it sounds like this. I really like that one. That's just crazy. This one's called Good Old Lead Tone. So quite like that one. That one's fun. I'll give you a couple of strat presets, strat octave riffs. So that's pretty fierce. You can throw on the top, uh, the top boost. And also you've got control of the EQ as well. You can boost that a bit more if you wanted. So that one's fun. Single called Girth. designed really to dig in hard when you play so it sounds really intense natural single coil vibes let's have a listen Rich and thick crunch.
So that one's fun. So this is one of the last presets I'll show you in this video. This is called Fuzz Town Down. Uh, it's one of the ones available in the description box because it wasn't included on the update because I only made it yesterday. But it's for humbuckers and it's like a fuzzy vibe one. <laughs> So that one's really, really fun because it's just filthy fuzz. Okay, so that concludes this video. I just wanted to show you some of the new presets on the new update of my Archetype plugin, including some of the cool ones that I've added in the description box. I want to say happy birthday again to Neural DSP uh, and thank you to Neural DSP for wanting to make this plugin with myself. I'm really, really proud of it. I'm going to do another video uh, talking about some tips and tricks of the plugin that you may not have thought about in terms of dialing in tones, specifically with the high gain amp to show you guys some of the cool things you can do with that. In any case, uh, that's this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the presets. I hope if you've grabbed this plugin or you're thinking about grabbing this plugin, firstly, thank you very much. I hope you enjoy it. It's really, really fun, super inspiring. Enjoy the presets and uh, let me know what you think in the comment section below. But until next time, I've been Rabir and I'll see you all very soon.